Hey everyone, in this video we're going to be testing out all the new outfits that were a part of the new Doomsday Heist DLC. So for this video we're just going to be testing out to see if you have any added protection while wearing some of this stuff. There are a ton of new vests, they look super armored. There's also two new helmets that look absolutely crazy. So let's not waste any time, let's get right into it. So if you're not wearing any sort of armored vest or anything, you will go down in 10 shots. And here we have the plate carrier vest, the ultralight vest, the light strike vest, the mid strike vest, the heavy strike vest, and the extreme strike vest all going down at the same 10 bullets. There's no added protection by wearing these things. They're all aesthetic. But that's pretty much what we've come to expect when receiving any new clothing. So as you know, if you're not wearing a helmet, you will die with one shot to the head. But if you're wearing one of the new shielded riot helmets, you will die in three shots to the head. So it does have some layer of protection. Keep in mind, this is the shielded riot helmet. But as for the other riot helmet, which is not shielded, it's just called the riot helmet, you will die in one shot. There's no added protection. Whether the visor's up, down, you get shot in the back of the head, doesn't matter, you will die in one shot. So if you were very serious about PvP, the only helmets you should be using are bulletproof helmets, combat helmets, and the new shielded riot helmet. Either one of those is fine. So that's going to do it for this video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm sorry this video was so short. There's not too much to talk about, so I didn't want to stretch it out too long. Before the video ends, I just need to thank a lot of people who have been helping out over the past few days. I want to thank Tails, Spybot, Kartov, Protein, Turkey, and anyone else who has helped in any particular way. If you're looking to join a gaming community and link up with other gamers just like you, then feel free to check out Waveform Gaming. This isn't a sponsorship or anything like that. This is just me trying to help a growing community. So let's help them out. I'll have a link to all their social medias and stuff, their Discord, Twitter, and all that sort of stuff down in the description below. You guys can check them out if you want. You guys can link up with each other, do heists together. It's just a very friendly gaming community. So with all that out of the way, thank you guys so much for watching and for everything gaming, you know where to find it right here at CGH.